assalamu alaikum students i hope you are all fine today is your third online class of class 9 federal board subject is chemistry today we will discuss some more basic definitions of chemistry learning object of this lecture at the end of this lecture you will be able to define and differentiate between empirical formula and molecular formula molecular mass and formula mass first we discuss empirical formula and molecular formula empirical formula tells us the simplest or lowest whole number ratio of atom in a compound whereas the molecular formula gives the actual or true number of atoms of each element in the formula of a compound let us consider the example of benzene the actual ratio of carbon to hydrogen atom in a molecule of benzene is 6 ratio 6 hence its molecular formula is c6h6 note that every number is divisible by 6 therefore the empirical formula of benzene is written as ch which shows the simplest whole number ratio now we discuss the molecular mass and formula mass the molecular mass of a substance is the sum of the atomic masses of all the atom in a molecule of the substance molecular mass is expressed in atomic mass unit next is formula mass the formula mass of the substance is the sum of the atomic masses of all atom in a formula unit of the compound whether molecule or not actually formula mass is used for ionic substances how can we calculate the molecular mass and the formula mass of a substance let us consider the example we can calculate the molecular mass of water the molecule of water contains two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen first multiply the atomic mass of hydrogen 1.008 and 6 oh, and oxygen 16 with the number of atoms of hydrogen and oxygen and then add the masses so we get the molecular mass of water that is 18.016 amu second in second example we can calculate the formula mass of sodium chloride sodium chloride contain one atom of sodium and one atom of chlorine multiply the atomic mass of sodium 23 and chlorine 35.5 with number of atoms and then add the masses so we get the formula mass of sodium chloride that is 58.5 amu i hope you will understand today's lecture now it's time to give you some home assignment do self assessment exercise 1.2 1.3 and 1.4 review question number 2 part 5 review question number 9 10 11 12 and 13 so that's all for today thank you